first. Uh, actually, not a bad thing at all. Got this off Amazon, as you can see from the box. Got a little pocket kind of thing for your MacBook accessories. This feels good. Nice size. Let me grab the iPad. Just want to see the iPad on the 11 inches. The I MacBook is like 13.3. Uh, yeah, I think I can probably get both of them in there. Yeah, it's not going to be a long video. Nice little front and back for the new Pro 13 for the new MacBook. Say for MacBook new Pro 13. <laughs> All right. Let me we'll get to this in a second. Let's open this up real quick. Uh, I don't want to damage it. Maybe I can get it from a little corner. Yeah, you don't want to scratch it up, so let's check this out. Oh, that's perfect. Because we got the little cutter, as you can see. You got to open that up, too. Don't want to poke through there just in case that ain't all the way like a hole or nothing. They're not playing with this. This plastic is no joke. It feels pretty good. I thought it was gonna be like a cheap plastic feel. No, it's not. Okay. Sorry about that if y'all hear that horn blowing. Someone probably acting crazy outside. Let's see this little thing. Okay, it's for the keyboard. And as you can see, it's made for the MacBook Pro with the touch bar. And the actual, that's how you know it's 2020 because it got the actual escape key. Let's move this on the side and grab this once again. I'm just gonna keep it open. Okay, this is like the protector. I don't know if I'm gonna use it or not. It's like a glass protector. No, not a, it's a film protector. I may use it. I used it before on a previous MacBook. I guess I ain't, got, I ain't got to open that up. So I can move this to the side for the moment. Move this stuff. I hate clutter. Clutter. Uh, I don't think I need none of these. I'll just keep it anyway. We're going to get to this in a second. Yeah, this is cool. Little vents so you can breathe. This whole package was like 39 bucks off Amazon. Come with all this stuff. Not bad. I like this. This is whatever. I'm, I don't know if I'm using that. This is pretty cool. Just so your uh, MacBook keyboards won't get uh, dust and stuff. But this i like this i like this cut out i like this material it is way better than i thought okay move this to the side and it come with this free let's open it up usb c can y'all see that usb c three four oh one two three four like, I guess you could say five and one. I don't know. It's four and one, really. Because it's one that said five and one. But yeah, something you could just use. It was free. So, 3.0s. So, to USB A. So, you could plug in flash drive, hard drive, stuff like that. It's cool. Pretty slim. Kind of wish it was space gray and not silver. Because the, the MacBook I got is space gray. So, but this is cool. I got a million of these. But if I show you the one I'm going to be using all the time and then that one is actually space gray it's gonna be the hub that i actually use all the time is this one right let me show you guys this one right here 
last year was BC. As you can see that, got the three USB A's, the big uh, micro uh, SD card, and then a the little one. I got actually another one with HDMI too, but this is the one I'm gonna use for now. And then I can show you another big hub that I'm gonna actually be using sometime. If you can see this, it's actually hooked up. Let me unhook it because I don't need it right now. Hold on one second. Let me uh, eject this because it got my flash drive in it. Okay. I can just take it off for a moment. All right. But this, let me take this out too. This got the big SD card, little SD card. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me see. Let me move this light down. So I don't know if you see it, but phone, uh, headphone jack, two USB Thunderbolt C ports, and then uh, 3.0 to you know A port for the flash drives. This is like a you know two in one flash drive with USB C, 128 gigs. I think this one is. And on the back, it got HDMI. It got the uh, the Ethernet cord. It's the power for it if you want to hook it to the power. It's the uh, VGA and two USB 2.0 on the, on the back and you know more uh, USB C ports. But this is mainly to hook it to the monitor. Like I hooked this to my uh, iMac, so that's what these ports for. You can hook it to the, like that, you know, to the computer. And it's like a little stand. Sometimes I may have it, you know, have my MacBook here and have this here. But nine out of ten times I use this for my my iMac that's what I use that one for for the iMac so but if I need more ports you know I got plenty of these in fact I got another one <laughs> let me show you I got this one. okay this is another one <laughs> I have plenty of these same thing if you can see that three USB uh, BA uh, 3.0 ports the big SD card little SD card that's all this one got but this one take the big SD card so I don't really be using that one too often Everything new is through uh, lightning. So, yeah. Be back with putting this stuff on the actual MacBook in a second. Okay. Be right back. All right, y'all. I'm back. Get everything set up on here. Now, let's get to the accessories. Just that little sleeve I showed you on that previous clip. Nothing, 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 no. We put this on in a second. Let's do a little wipe down of this. It got a little dirty, I guess, being in the thing. So let's see if we can just close this down. Snap this on here real quickly. Let's see how this thing will work on here. Hoping it just work easy. Turn this over. Seen this snap on pretty easy. Yeah. I think it's on there good. Let me just make sure. Uh, I think so. I definitely think so. Let's put the bottom on there and uh like I said another clip. I don't know if I'm using that little screen protector. Let's put, let's close this down. Put the bottom on. I want to drop it. Seems like it's perfect for the vents. Let's make sure everything's on here click good. Worst thing you, you want to do is drop it before you even put the case on it good. But I like that cutout. Do you can see that? And this feels premium. This Material, I don't know what they use, but it ain't leather. But it feels like leather. A little mark on there, I don't know what that is, but feels good. Let's see about this. Let's see if this works. Let's grab a little flash drive just to see if this works. Not that I'm going to be really even using this thing, this particular piece. 
All right, let's just try it out to see if it's even working. Yeah, it's turned blue. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Ain't got no movies in there. Uh, let's test these speakers out. Let's play some copyright free music, of course. No, not that. <laughs> let's play something else. Come on, let's find something good. Not that it matters, but I want to at least find something half decent. All right, it's taking too long. Come on. No. That's fine, I don't care. Let's just see how loud this is. Okay. That sounds good. Let's pause this for a second. Let's open up Safari. First, let's cut the screen up a little bit. Uh, it's a little duh, duh. So let's go to YouTube. One thing I'm loving already is this that Magic Keyboard from the 2020 uh, MacBook. Let's type in Brandon and Marcy. This is exactly what I hope you guys do to find my channel. This is my last video. Hope you guys watched it. Let's just see how everything's on. Do you see the quality of that? Yeah. Make sure you can get it good. That quality is good. That look good. I like the actual physical escape. A lot of people don't like the um, touch bar. But I'm loving it. I like the already the the um, touch ID they got on here. Let me eject this because I don't need it. Move that to the side, but yeah. Let's just go to a website or something. I just want to see how the scrolling is. Then I'll talk to y'all for a few seconds. Yeah, it's just smooth like it's supposed to be. Let's just close it down for a minute so I can just talk to y'all for a few seconds. One thing I want to say is you know, who is this MacBook for? You know, I got the, um, this MacBook was not the base model. This was the, I think it was $1399 with um, 512 gigabytes and uh, eight gigs of RAM with the i5 quad core. Yeah, I think it was $1399. I think I got it for $1299 with the uh, student discount. A lot of people don't know, you can go on Apple site and you can get the student discount from Apple, even though I didn't get this from Apple, I actually got it from Best Buy. Best Buy uh, um, price matched Apple. Let me put this on too in a minute, but forgot. They also gave me these free, free AirPods. I haven't even opened them yet because I'll use them. These are the pros, so I use them. So what I did was I went to Best Buy and I uh, told, I asked the uh, Apple rep that that's at Best Buy, do they price match Apple? He said, yeah, of course. So he gave me $100 off the actual um, computer. Plus they gave me these free because that's what Apple promotion is. You get a free AirPods, you buy a MacBook. So let me open this back up. Get this. But yeah, a lot of people don't know. You don't actually have to be a student to get either. My wife is a student, but I didn't have to verify nothing. I didn't have to do anything. All I do is tell them that I wanted the student discount. I didn't have to do anything to get it though. So you guys remember that. Anything you want off Apple, that's a computer or iPad Pro or anything to do with school, IMAX, anything, they give you money off. You just gotta tell them. You don't even have to have, let's see how I type with this. You don't even have to have nothing. Let's type in Mac, but Pro, let's see. Yeah, now this little keyboard, you know, this thing, is it raised up a little bit? No, it's actually pretty cool. It's sitting on there flush. But yeah, I like this little thing that came on here. 
free AirPods. I got $100 off the computer. That's a good deal. But I think this computer um, is for anybody who does YouTube. I think it's perfect for YouTubers. I think it's perfect for college students because the MacBook Air gets hot. Anything that you do to the MacBook Air, not saying this one, don't. If you push this one, it'll get hot. That's all Apple computers. They all get hot if you push them. But with that new MacBook 2020 Air, it's uh, it gets hot, super hot. It's just the way they designed it. It says something about the processor's not connected to the fan or something like that, and this one is. So this one stay cooler longer, and it's a MacBook Pro, so it's allow you to do you know more things. But if you need it, like if you're a professional video editor, you professional graphic designer, you know, then you probably uh, want to step up to like the 16 inch. But I got this 5K iMac, and I do most of my big tasks on there. This is gonna be a little light Photoshop stuff. I'm gonna do. Um, little little things on here like start a project on here and maybe then maybe send it over to my iMac you know because that's a 27 inch 5k screen so it's the color accuracy is better when I'm doing graphic designs but I just pretty much got this so when I don't want to be stuck in a chair at my desk I could be in the bed I could be on the couch I could take this with me you know that's why I wanted it and then I got a good deal of course got these free that I might end up I don't know I might end up once I get to a certain amount, I want, you know, once I get to a thousand subscribers, I will give a pair of these free. A pair of these free. So, might not be this exact pair, but a pair of these free. Once we get to 1,000 subscribers, I will do um, a giveaway. But, um, yeah, so far I'm already liking this. It's just like my iMac. It's just in this form. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I want to make this video longer than what it already is. But, so far, you know, first impressions with it. I had I had the MacBook Pro from last year, the 2019. I liked it a lot, but then I ended up returning that for the 5K iMac. So now I got the 5K iMac, so I needed something more portable. Even though I got the uh, iPad, you know, Pro, the iPad Pro 11 inch, which is wonderful too. I use that, but this got, you know, Mac apps and Pro apps, stuff I can't do on the iPad yet, which I hope one day that I would be able to, you know, everybody wants that, but I don't know, so far, my first impressions, I love it. I think um, if you can get a good deal like I did, you know, grab one, you know, uh, to give you these, of course, like I said, a million times already. Um, these accessories were cheap off Amazon. I think this case was, this whole this whole thing came in a package with this, this, slit, this glass protector thing, this sleeve, all this came into a bundle deal for about 30, I believe 30 bucks, somewhere around there. It wasn't too much more than that. And uh, yeah, it got this. Is look, let me close it up again to so see I can look around. The ports and everything. Everything cut out perfect. You can open it up good. See? Yeah. I almost was about to step up to the 16 gig. Um, 16 gigs of RAM with the four Thunderbolt three ports, but I ain't need all that. This is perfect. This is like right above the base model. So. It's perfect. Only thing I did was get more storage. The other one is 256 gigs, I believe, and this one is uh, 512. I just wanted more storage, even though I use my flash drive. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. This has uh, been another video from the coolest YouTuber ever, your boy Brandon. You know, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you have any questions about this MacBook. You know, if you're in school, you want to know how it types with the new Magic Keyboard. You don't know if it get real hot from doing editing or, you know, I'm going to push it to its limits. And if you got any questions on it, like I say, feel free to leave a comment and let's have a discussion about it. And um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button again. I'm on the road to a thousand and I will be giving away a free AirPod at a thousand subscribers. So the quicker we get there, the quicker somebody can win a lucky free pair of AirPods. Uh, thank you guys again for watching. Love you. Peace. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and hit, hit that, that subscribe, subscribe button, button to join B&M Gang. Game.